Hello everyone out there in the internet lands and YouTube. Um, so this vlog is going to be for 5-23-2016 and um, you guys haven't seen me in about three weeks and that was because on my last video upload, uh, the Vapor Tornado, um, the night that I uploaded it, I received an email from YouTube and that email states as you may know, our community guidelines describe which content is allowed and doesn't allowed. Anyhow, the basics of it go through and describe the video content restrictions and impacts and strikes. And it states how to make a bot YouTube like and proxy tester response video was flagged for review. Upon review, they determined that it violates the guidelines and it was removed and assigned to the community and I was assigned a community guidelines strike or temporary penalty to my account. Now, if you don't know what that means, um, basically my account is now in bad standing because I've got a single strike on May 3rd, 2016. As you may know, blah, blah, blah. It's the basic same description. What I didn't like is I came in here to learn what my video violated. And apparently it fell under the unwanted software policy. At Google, we believe that the focus on users uh, all else will follow, blah, 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 blah. Basically, we found that most unwanted software displays one of the same basic character, one or more of the same basic characteristics. It is deceptive, promising a value, uh, pr promising a value proportion that doesn't, it does not meet. It tries to trick the user into installing it or piggybacking its installation of another program. It doesn't tell you the user uh, the user about all the principles and significant functions. It affects the user system in unexpected ways. It is difficult to remove. It collects or transmits private information without the user's knowledge. It is bundled with other software and its presence is not disclosed. So from what I can tell, I've read through, hold on. I've read through this entire thing, and at no point do I see where I violated one of these rules. So I went ahead and appealed it, and it, it took less than 24 hours to them to get back to me and tell me that they were going to uphold the decision to block that video. Now, at no time during that video did I ever say that you were going to get a thousand likes. I did not say that this was going to be a bot that, that is going to get you a million likes at one time. Um, the entire video, it shows exactly what it does. I never encourage you to go download anything. I never encourage you to go and do anything except program and script and learn. So it's very discouraging to see that it got flagged. And uh, I want to go and fight it. I want to go and appeal this further because I still don't believe that that video had any malicious intent or in malicious software in it. Um, if you think I'm wrong, comment to me something. Um, also, if you have a problem with one of my videos, let me know and I will look at it and tell you, yes, you have a point because sometimes I get off on a tangent and maybe I say something that might offend someone somewhere sometime. But for the last three weeks, I've been stewing on this and just trying to wrap my head around what happened. So uh, until further notice, my account is now locked down to 15 minute video increments. Um, I'm not allowed to live stream at any given time and I have to wait six months before the strike will get removed from my account. Uh, at which time it should go back into good standing and I'll be able to do the big videos again. But until then, all my tutorials, all of my um, scripting and walkthroughs, they're going to be 15 minute increments. And I'm going to have to upload them one video at a time. So no more bulk uploads. Yeah, um, this should get me back on track. I'm going to be back into making more videos. Uh, as you saw last night, I put in two more. So that's a good thing. Uh, I will be starting back in on the JavaScript series, or not JavaScript, Java series. Uh, I will be starting back in on the Java series because I didn't realize somebody's actually watching those and they're going through a class and they're on the same chapter that I left off on. So I will start back in on those.
Um, I've also had a request for some C. C I've also had a request for some C sharp programming. Uh, I will start in on one of my books that I had from then and run through it. Um, Roblox. Uh, me and the kids have been playing a lot of Roblox lately, so I'll be playing Roblox. It's summertime; the kids are out, so they get to stay up later. So now uh, we don't get to record until the weekends. So yeah, that's that. Um, other than that, it's been a pretty good three weeks. Uh, just kind of took a break, and I haven't been stressing over too much except work and family. Uh, family first, and it's been really good. I've got a lot of playtime with kids, uh, a lot of uh, together time with the wife. Um, we've been playing video games and just hanging around the house, cooking, eating food. So... Uh, by the way, this background is not my room. It is a green screen, but I thought it was awesome because I could recognize everything that was in here. The power glove and all that. So, it's a really cool background. Thank you to uh, whoever uploaded it to YouTube. Or not to YouTube, to um, uh, Google. Thank you for the background. Um, hmm. That didn't really fill up as much time as I thought it would. Okay. Well, we'll see. We'll see what kind of scripting comes up and what kind of program I'll do. Until then, stay tuned. Thanks for all your likes and subscribes and videos. Um, I still have to do a draw my life video, which, ah, again, I was so discouraged with the the letter and the intent and all that. But you know what? Just keep uploading. Just keep moving forward. That's. That's what I've got to say to myself whenever stuff like this happens. So, here we go. Stay tuned. Good night, everyone.